as the 2019 general elections approach. The Independent National Electoral Commission continues to make efforts to ensure a free, fair and credible process for all Nigerians. In Niger State, the Commission says it has registered a total of 82,000 voters since the commencement of the continuous voters' registration in 2017. But so far, only 30% of registered voters have collected their permanent voters' card. 70% of those permanent voters' cards are yet to be collected. That adds to the 132,000 uncollected PVCs that we had from 2011 to 2014. We are still hoping that the owners, those who are alive, will come forward to collect them. But some residents seem not to be on the same page with the Commission as they complain about the inefficiency of INEC to meet their demands for registration. It wasn't easy. I feel, I, I, I in particular, I know that I, I have been here since around six. And I have know of people, I know of people that have slept even here. It is a very tough, I mean, people, one would be even discouraged to even continue doing the exercise because there is no ease in doing it. Most times I even think of, I don't really want it any longer, but it's compulsory because in this life we really need to go out for the change when we need the change. And in Quara State, a training is organized for INEC, legal and police officers on prosecution of election offenses. The perpetration of uh, electoral offenses contributes to the distortion of the election outcomes. Therefore, clear, properly understood and uh, implemented mechanisms for prosecution of election offences are necessary to make the electoral process less controversial and contentious as possible. This training of children therefore is expected to produce recommendations on how the participants will overcome the hurdles or delay outcome of investigation. As Nigeria prepares for her general elections and with less than eight days away from the August 17 deadline for the continuous voters registration exercise to come to an end, hopes are high that the country will have a successful outcome.